What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Definitely check out the private Discord server in the description below. And let's just check out Dogecoin. This is by far one of the hottest things so far. It's getting so hot to the point that institutional traders are jumping in. Big banks, big hedge funds are placing massive block orders for Dogecoin because not a lot of people have like $33 million to blow on a meme coin, okay? Even like major billionaires have trouble doing that. Now, for example, this account right here, they did sell a total of 700 million coins, but they still have 3 billion Doge coins. That is a lot of money. And they have $1.68 billion worth. And Dogecoin is getting fire hot, guys. Dogecoin is so strong that today, Dogecoin did go to 69 cents before dropping back down to 51.4 and then rebounding very strong back to roughly 67 and now it's chilling at 63.7 cents. It's really, really strong. Of all the altcoins out there, I have never seen a meme coin being this strong and this resistant against drops. I feel like of all of the crypto investments, traders out there, this one is their favorite. Because of Musk, you got the Saturday night live event coming up. Right now, it's May 5th. It's a Wednesday. Saturday is coming right around the corner. So prepare yourselves, finish up your exams. It's time to check out some more Dogecoin news. Right now, you also have Nova Gratz, who is a multi-billionaire. And he is essentially saying that Dogecoin is pretty volatile. The sustainability is very questionable. But he also says that you don't want to short Dogecoin at all. Right now, there's a lot of people in the media trying to paint Dogecoin in bad light. And essentially, they're encouraging people to just give up on the coin. But I feel like a lot of traders out there, even institutional ones, don't care what those guys have to say. There's so much negative press about Dogecoin, and it's just not that cool. And you also have Nova Gratz here, the multi-billionaire. He didn't really say that he loved Dogecoin, but he did say if you want to short Dogecoin, you better double check yourself because it's dangerous because Dogecoin could just keep going up and a dollar is probably coming soon. Even Fortune is talking about how Dogecoin going to a dollar is gonna happen. It's just about when. Now, we do have some big things about Musk here because the Saturday Night Live event is pretty big and recently Musk is on the streets and he autographed some toy cars, you know, some posters, magazines, stuff like that and actually asked fans about Dogecoin. He asked fans if Doge was their number one choice and a bunch of people started saying yes. And then Musk was later asked that whether or not he's gonna be making Making a lot of jokes about Dogecoin, he says we will see. Now we should be seeing some big things about Doge because Musk is most likely preparing a lot of big things. There was another tweet I covered in a different video where someone says, will Musk talk about Dogecoin? Will he summon the Doge father? And eventually Musk is like, definitely. I think Elon Musk has a pretty big event piling up. He has a lot of data, a lot of cool stuff ready for Dogecoin. I think he's pretty excited himself because you don't just be on the streets and start talking about Dogecoin if you don't really have that much to say for the upcoming SNL event. Musk actually has a very track record when it comes to big events like these. When he said battery day will absolutely give you a big wow, it was pretty incredible. Like the 4680 battery cells for the Tesla vehicles was a lot denser, had nickel, charging speeds were faster and it's twice as big as the previous battery cell. And it's really, really good. It could make like a Model S go like 700, 800 miles on a single charge with a 4680 battery cell. And same thing with this time. We should be seeing big news about Dogecoin because even Musk himself is getting pretty excited about Dogecoin. We gotta talk about the technical analysis aspect of Dogecoin because this is pretty important by itself. So right now Dogecoin is chilling pretty well at 60 cents, 65 cents around this region. So you do have this consolidation period right here. You got a second one right here and then you have a third one. And after the third one, you got a massive drop and then a massive surge, just like what I predicted. Now, what I predict next is a massive drop down and then a massive surge up, forming a W shape, consolidation in preparation for the SNL event before climbing all the way back up once again. Now, the reason why I say this is because that technical analysis charting that I just did is very similar to Dogecoin back in mid-April when it had its first initial surge and its first big fame. You do have Dogecoin consolidated in here, Dogecoin's chilling here, and then it consolidated right here, just like before. Very similar to the three circles I drew. And then it started going down, going up, going down, forming a W shape, consolidation. And of course, this time it's a little bit different because it's in the very beginning phase of Dogecoin. We've got a pretty massive drop and then a massive surge. Now, if you check out right now, I feel like Dogecoin after the W shape charting would not go down. Instead, it will most likely go up. 
And the reason behind this is there's so much catalyst. You do have Musk coming off the SNL event. Some people feel like it might trigger a massive sell-off, but keep in mind the Saturday night event will definitely be attracting a lot of buyers from around the world. If you think that only North Americans are actually buying Dogecoin, you're wrong because there's Europeans out there buying it. There's a lot of people around the world. It's super popular in Korea, Japan, China, the European countries. It's fire. Pretty much every country around the world that has access to internet, you know, crypto trading, all that stuff, they're buying Dogecoin. It's a super popular currency and you probably have your average millionaire right next door buying Dogecoin right now, maybe 10, 20, 30,000 dollars worth and they're just simply sitting on it. So I feel like the technical analysis aspect is Dogecoin could easily be hitting a dollar, no doubt. And right now Doge is just consolidating around this price tag and it's not really moving that much. I feel like this massive surge is a little bit too strong. I think people started feeling the FOMO. In fact, Fear of missing out is such a big thing with Doge right now. You even have Meek Mill just straight up saying that he's tired of missing out on the gains of Dogecoin. And last night he spent like $50,000 on Dogecoin, which is pretty crazy. And I covered a video about that. People got pretty hyped up. But right now Dogecoin is just chilling at roughly 64 cents. It's probably gonna consolidate around this area, not really move that much. But the more it consolidates, the better because eventually it will spike up. If you guys are waiting for a chance to buy Dogecoin on a drop, well, today was the day because it did drop to 51.4 cents at one point before rebounding back up. Now, overall, I feel like Doge is pretty strong. You have several billionaires out there. For example, Nova Gratz, the CEO of Galaxy Digital, he's also saying that he's kind of skeptical of Dogecoin, but at the same time, he will never bet it going down because it's just so strong. He got Musk coming in, Mark Cuban, all this stuff. And it's big. Everyone knows that this SNL event will be pretty enormous for Dogecoin because we could be seeing Musk talking about the real life implications for this new altcoin. Everyone is waiting to see what they have to do. But right now, if you check out Dogecoin, there's a lot of volatility, a lot of major accounts right now having huge transaction volumes. Volume is spiking for Dogecoin. This volume at an hourly basis of roughly 200 to 500 million is way bigger than before of 59 to 150 million. So volume is spiking up, but volume isn't too outrageous. I don't like it when there's too much volume, meaning that there's a lot of people selling and a lot of people buying. It's just super volatile and very hectic. That's about it guys, thanks for watching. Comment below, definitely check out the private Discord server. You won't regret it, it's $12 a month. If you don't like it, cancel before June 1st for free. So that's like a four week free trial going on and it's pretty lit. We got several different types of options trades, 80 to 90% win rates. We also have a brand new crypto section. It's like your own little mini Bloomberg terminal. It's very, very nice. And also check out BlockFi, link in the description, click on it, make a BlockFi account, deposit some money and get up to $250 worth of Bitcoin, and you can actually buy Dogecoin on BlockFi. So that's pretty nice. Thanks for watching, guys.